Roofs are ripped off of houses and power lines are down after a storm system with high winds came through mid-Missouri earlier today. And the city of Sedalia got some of that damage today. ABC 17's Elizabeth Dusenberg takes us to Sedalia for a damage report. Today's high winds almost made it seem like a tornado whipped through the city. As you can see, the winds in Sedalia were so strong that they were able to knock over this mailbox and then parts of people's roofs. The gusts of winds also brought down trees and power lines, and one resident said she did not expect it to be so powerful. Like a train coming through, but it was really heavy downpour. Can't see out the windows. One business I drove by barely had a roof. Over 3,500 houses were without power, and KCPNL provides electricity for the city. They tell me 20 power lines were down, but they sent additional crews to the scene and were able to restore power to most of the residents. The Pettis County Sheriff's Dispatch lost its 911 terminals when the power went out, but they have been restored. Two people are without a home tonight after an explosion in Cole County. We told you it's breaking news on ABC17news.com. Crews responded just before noon to the 2200 block of Country Club Drive. The homeowner told fire crews his lawnmower exploded after he used it this morning. Fire officials tell us the strong winds made the fire spread faster to other parts of the house. Crews responded and gained control of that blaze in about 15 minutes. They say that no one was injured. We did have several other calls come in at the same time that we had to use mutual aid to cover those other calls. So, but uh, all in all, it's pretty much a total loss. The owner of the home says that he's devastated for the loss, but is happy that no one was hurt.